Hello there and welcome to the final video for this year uh, for Halloween Fishing Planet Halloween 2020 and I'm at San Joaquin and I have completed all the bits of the mission for Halloween so I am going to add all of these bits from all of the uh, completed tasks and there they all are and I can't actually remember from the first time I did this what um, strength of rod and everything I used um, but bearing in mind I have caught 45 to 50 kilogram gar certainly 45 kilogram gar with this with um, cranks and shads on um, I'm hoping I won't have too much of a problem what I probably will do I think is borrow my trusty thunder spin so let's just put something in there as a placeholder so we don't lose all our tackle setup so I mentioned in the previous video that I'm going to make a video because I've completed the extra Frankenfish mission on my other account, on my uh, Steam account, and I'm going to make a, a double Frankenfish uh, video. Uh, but this is really just um, just to finish the one-off on my on my Microsoft account. So let's give this a go and see what happens so we should be able to put all the bits in the cauldron and the sea should go sorry the lake should go all red I wonder what that vein line I think that vein line may that's only 13 I don't know whether we need to equip gear up properly well let's give this a go I've done it on my other account on the original mission and I've done it on my original account my um, steam account on the supplementary one this year but of course that's much higher grade kit higher spec rods and everything that sounds like the beast so this may take me a little while to bring in so far it looks to be behaving itself And there we go, that's it guys, that's what the last two weeks have been about. Fairly horrible looking thing. And um, yeah, there we go, so we get 3,729 money and 1088 XP. And that goes in the keep net and we get a monstrosity kayak now for those of you who missed my last video if you had to buy the DLC with the uh, spinners in it in order to get the roach spoon which a lot of people have had to do 
I let's find it. I this one here because you can collect all of the others. Uh, the roach spoon and the spider spoon are extraordinarily elusive, and uh, I believe that's just a ruse to uh, to get you to buy this DLC. Anyway, if you did have to buy this DLC for 99 bait coins, you should now find that when you go back to your inventory, let's um, inventory won't show it because I've got my normal kayak here, but if we leave now and go home. We should see that that kayak is now sellable. Let's find it in the home. If we click sell, oh, it's actually 70 bait coins now. They've reduced it. They the first time round when I first did this mission, you could uh, sell it for a hundred bait coins, but you can at least get 70 of your 99 back, and you've probably collected a fair few more than that. On, along the way uh, so it's not too bad and the monstrosity is I can tell you a monstrosity you might just want to um, just for novelty value go for a paddle in it uh, but you'll probably want to be selling that pretty much straight away and it does depreciate so um, if you're gonna sell it I would get on and sell it anyway that's it guys for another year for Halloween look out for my video to come where I compare this mission, this Halloween mission, with the uh, the sort of add-on extra one they've brought out this year, which I've completed on my other account. And also I'm going to be doing a video sometime soon on analysis of Blue Crab Island, where I'm doing some farming at the moment on my other account. And uh, yeah, just to uh, give you some idea of how to farm XP to get up from 54 up to 58 um, or Maku Maku and then on to 63 for Maron River so that video will be on my other account but will be coming out soon and uh, good luck if you're gonna have a go at completing the Halloween mission and uh, I'll see you again next time